Miss Shella, who is this person? Anthony D. Anthony was your roommate. Yes. And then the three of you, Anthony, you, and Mr. Bates, became roommates. Correct. No. Well, all three of you lived together. Yes. yes. In an apartment that was yours, and you were on the lease? It was a house. A house. And only you were on the lease? I was on the lease, and Anthony was on the lease. And give me the period of time when you were all living together. From June of 2016 through present. Well, he doesn't live there anymore. Correct. Excuse me. He moved out May 9th. And am I correct? Mr. Bates, that it was the practice while you were all living together for the plaintiff and Anthony would give you their share of the rent, which was how much? My, uh, we each paid 606.67. And you would pay the landlord? For the second two years, yes, ma'am. The first year, we split the rent between just Anthony and myself. But the last two years, it was the three of you. And Anthony and Miss Schiller would each give you either in cash did you give it to me in cash or cash. check? Cash. Cash, six zero six sixty three, And you would write a check to the landlord, or I you would pay the landlord? I would go and get a cashier's check. Check and pay the landlord pay each the landlord. month. Yes. And then, according to your answer, you ran into some financial difficulty. In what month and year was that? October of 2015, I started having financial problems. Okay. At some point, you fell behind, let's say, fell behind in the rent. In what month was that? October or November of 2016. And did that mean, Mr. Bates, that you did not pay the rent at all, let's say, starting in November or December? Uh, I did not pay for four months. Four months. Okay, which four months? It may have been October, December, March, and April. Okay, so those four months. The exact dates, I'm not exactly so sure. It could have been five months. Possibly, yes. How many months was it, Ms. Schiller? Five. Okay, great. She has the documentation that it's five months. Okay, now, we agree Ms. Schiller and Anthony, during those five months, gave you 606.63 each. Yes, ma'am. And those funds you converted to your own use because you did not pay those funds to the landlord. Correct. And then Miss Schiller and Anthony, who were notified, I don't care how they were notified, I don't care if it came by carrier pigeon or whatever, they were notified <laughs> that the landlord was kicking you out of the house for non-payment of rent. They say, what do you mean? We gave bread our rent, but bread was keeping our rent. And they wanted to stay in the apartment or house. So Miss Schiller paid the back rent. So now she's paid the rent twice. I she just a second. She does, she's going to prove that to me. Okay. Just a minute. You don't know that, but she's going to prove it to okay. me that she paid the rent in order to permit her and Anthony to stay in the house, and they kicked you out because I have a counterclaim. And that's what the case is about. She paid the money that she and Anthony had already given to you. She paid the landlord again so that they could maintain the house, and now she is suing you for the money she gave you already. Correct. I don't see an issue here. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe you want to tell me what the issue is because the only thing that you say in your answer is, since Miss Schiller was not on the lease, the landlord could not have come against her for the back rent, and therefore, if she chose to pay the back rent that she already paid, that was her choice, and I shouldn't have to give her back the money. Is that your defense? My defense is that she was not on the lease and that I moved out of the house in May. And what she did after that, I have no idea. OK. Well, that's but, not a defense, Mr. But Bates. But the person that I owe would be the landlord or the property management company. No, she paid them already. I, so she steps into their shoes. I don't know that well, she well, did Well, I'm telling you. Well, th that's what she's going to prove to me, okay. that she did, in fact, pay in order to remain in the house because you stole her money. You stole her money. Stole his money. I don't know why he's not on it. But I don't know if he paid or she paid. I don't know who paid. But you stole her money.